champion in LA Knight, a man who is obsessed with reaching the top of the mountain for the first time in his WWE career. It is going to be a long, difficult night for the Tribal Chief. And I bet, I bet none of y'all thought, what's up, Miami? I, I bet none of y'all thought that Randy Orton was friends with Eladio. It's pretty wild, right? <laughs> hey, man, thanks for putting me in your music video, by the way. Please show some love to my man, Eladio. He deserves every bit of it. Now, I'm here to talk business. I'm here to talk, I'm here to talk the bloodline. Now, whether you like him or not, the bloodline has had one hell of a run these last few years. One hell of a run. And the main reason they have done so is because Roman Reigns has held the world title for almost 1,300 days. That, ladies and gentlemen, is unfathomable. <laughs> It's virtually unheard of. Nobody can stop him. Nobody can stop the, blood, the bloodline. Nobody well except for maybe, maybe me. <laughs> you see, because tomorrow's the Royal Rumble. And once all the smoke clears and the dust settles, the only number that's gonna mean anything to anybody is the number 15. I'll tell you why. Because after I beat Roman Reigns at the Royal Rumble, I am going to be a 15-time world champion. And how you think I'm gonna go about accomplishing that? What's that? And I'll tell you how I'm going to do that. I'll tell you how I'm going to become a 15-time world champion by beating Roman Reigns tomorrow at the Royal Rumble. I'm going to do it courtesy of the three most destructive letters in sports entertainment, R-K-O. There's other people in this match with Roman Reigns, don't you, Randy? Or did you just look past AJ Styles? Well, to you, I'd say join the club. You see, I asked Nick Aldis to let me have a match against Solo Sokoa so I could take his head off. And he gave that match to a man who stepped over my body to get everything he's ever wanted in the WWE, L.A. Knight. Did you forget about me, Randy? As long as you've been in this business, as long as you've been in the WWE, you should know better. We have history, Randy. And after you RKO'd me in this ring last week, just know you got a receipt coming. And at the Royal Rumble tomorrow night, I'll be stepping over Randy Orton, Roman Reigns, and L.E.
What an ovation for the megastar. Let me talk to you. AJ, go ahead, have a time with it, because you were about to say the name of the next WWE Champion with everybody saying... Yeah! But my God, AJ, since you've come back, all you've done is whine, cry, and complain. Everybody's jumping over me. Everybody's stepping over me. <laughs> Quit your crying, dummy. You think for a second, with 24 hours before we have our fatal four-way, you think for a second that I want to fight the muscle, the enforcer of the bloodline solo? You'd be smart if you weren't so damn stupid. I tell you like this, as far as I can see, isn't it a little bit convenient? Four men in that match tomorrow for the WWE Championship, and only I have a match tonight. Isn't that a chin scratcher? That tells me Paul Heyman lobbied, did everything he could to make sure to soften me up. Why? Because I'm the biggest threat. He saw it at Crown Jewel. He's seen it ever since. So here's the deal. I'm gonna walk in tonight. I ain't gonna complain about it. I gotta fight solo, that's what I'll do. I'll hit him so damn hard, he'll start doing his dad's dance move. And then with that same energy, I'll walk right into Royal Rumble. I will walk over you, I'll walk over you and your little voices, I'll walk over Roman Reigns, and I'll walk over any single sorry soul that gets in my way of being the WWE Champion. And that's not an insult, that. It's just a fact of life. Yeah. yeah. L.A. Knight fired up tonight. Yeah, He's stepping over. Damn right, I'll step over. Oh! I'll step over. Oh! AJ with a Pele kick to Orton. And what did he say about a receipt, Corey? AJ warned the Viper. There's a receipt coming your way tonight in the form of a Pele kick. But in 24 hours, when the undisputed WWE Universal Championship is on the line, much like the Royal Rumble match itself, it will be every man for himself. And Roman Reigns has three extremely motivated...